Hey, what's going on guys? We're going to go over the buttons on the printer here. If you just looked at our uh, previous video on the kit, what's included, uh, thanks for checking that out. And if you haven't seen that one yet, maybe you're interested in the uh, the kit, what's included with it, you might want to check out our YouTube channel. So uh, let's go ahead and start off with the first button here. So we're going to go ahead and start off with this one right here. This feeds and then cuts the tape. And then on the side here, this is where the, you got your tape eject slot. Now you can tell it's wide. This pr does print some pretty wide labels. So if you're looking for something that, you know, does something more than, I don't know, a half inch, then this is what you're looking for. Okay. Um, so this would be the print your label button. Go ahead and press that and it'll go ahead and print whatever you got going on. And number four, this would be the general button here. And it creates a general label. You have your character keys. So you got your numbers up there and you got your letters, obviously. You have your shift button right there. Now this particular button right there, looks like you got three A's right there. This enters a character with an accent. The button right next to it changes the input method of the character keys. The one right below it, just, there we go. The one right below it, this creates a label with a sequence number. Now, if you're looking for something that creates barcode, you got that button right there. That's perfect. So it's pretty nice. This printer does, uh, obviously, as you can tell so far, it's got a lot of features here. A lot of print options for you. Another thing, it does have, this particular button right here, many, many different symbols. I mean, it's it's packed with symbols. You're going to lose your mind with how many symbols this thing has. Um, I was pretty impressed, actually. Now, right here, okay, you got your cursor keys. And the one right in the center, that confirms the setting. And over here, you'll notice column. That adds a block. The one right above it sets the margins. And the one right above that one sets the tape length. All right. This particular one right here sets the format and the style. You have the one right next to it changes the font size. Just like your computer, this is the space button. Now, more towards the top, You'll notice that the, it does have, let me go ahead and zoom in a little bit here for you. Particular buttons are um, already kind of designated for a special label. So you have your punch block, your patch panel for your communication guys. You have your wrap and it even has a faceplate button. The button right next to it over here at the end, you go ahead and press that and that'll delete whatever you have going on. And you got your power button right above it. Right next to it, previews the created label. And this one right in the center, the folder, this saves and recalls the label. And you got your display right there. It is a backlit display, so um, if you're in a pretty dark area, it's a nice, nice extra for you. For more detailed spec sheet on this particular printer, you might want to check out our YouTube channel and also visit discountlowvoltage.com. Thanks.